And away we go. It's Monday, March 18th, 2019. Things are shaking. Spring is coming. And maybe here for some of you. Welcome, everybody, to our weekly team call. Uh, my name is Mark Harris. I live in Lee Summit, Missouri, where weather has not yet decided which way it's going to go. We, we see things trending upwards. Um, but more, more fun than that, more important than that, we see lots and lots of new people coming to discover what we know as a transformational opportunity and line of products that are bringing life. By definition, they're bringing life on uh, every level of human physiology, um, our emotions, our mentality, our families, our finances. And so if you're brand new to this group, welcome. Uh, you have found a ragtag fugitive group of co-conspirators that are off to change the world. So you're in the right place at the right time, the right, with the right people doing the right things for the right reasons. Uh, tonight, we're really privileged off the back of um, not only a, an outstanding Life Energy Academy uh, weekend where we had uh, over 28, I think, national locations where um, Pro 8, 9, and 10 um, speakers went out and to give four hours of hopefully some transformational training and teaching where you were, but also we had a couple folks in our team uh, that were privileged enough to attend the Pro 5 Summit out in Park City, Utah, sponsored by Life Vantage Corporate. And we've got one of those leaders on the call tonight. And uh, I asked Stephanie if she wouldn't mind sharing some of her experiences, what it was like to be a Pro 5, some life um, takeaways or business takeaways, and maybe offer some thoughts uh, for our team tonight. And then we will kick it right over to our elite Pro 7, Julie White who attended a really cool function. I'll let her tell you about here in just a second. But Stephanie, I see you're on. I'm gonna mute myself and make sure everybody else is muted. Will you take a few minutes and just share your heart? Sure, thank you, Mark. You bet. Yeah, so uh, last weekend, not this past weekend, but the weekend before, uh, I went to the Pro5 Summit in Salt Lake City area, Utah, and uh, it was really a life-changing event which I'm sure you could imagine. Um, this was the, the second trip that I've been on with Life Vantage where there was, it, we went on the Puerto Vallarta incentive trip back in the fall and you just get a different look at the company and your experience within it when, um, when all of your expenses are paid and you get to just kind of rub shoulders with other leaders. Uh, and so there's a lot of, I think what we took away from it that is sort of hard to communicate because it wasn't so much in exactly what was said or shared, but rather in just the experience of it. I mean, it was like just being able to just sit face to face with Taylor Worry, um, or even Patty Worry. We got to sit at a table with her one day, um, Patty Worry is Eric Worry, the network marketing trainer guru. His mother um, is a distributor in our company, and she was attending the Pro5 Summit as a distributor. And so we got to sit at, we sit with her at lunch one of the days that we were there and just kind of listen to her share about how she's been in network marketing her entire life. Uh, and she's worked with several different companies and she, she chose Life Vantage as her, her home, like her final stop <laughs> in terms of um, <clears throat> network marketing. And I think just being around people like that, it's just really humbling. You, you realize that this is just so much bigger than, or at least this is how it was for me. I, every time we go on one of these trips, I just see how much bigger this is than I ever really understood when I got started. And, uh, and I think that is really um, what marked us. Now, there was a lot of great uh, teaching. Some of it would be familiar from what we've heard at um, the recent Elite Academy in Charleston. But there was something that Scott Satterfield, who is a pro nine, who was at the, the summit, uh, and he did some of the teaching seminars. There was a principle that he taught about that I wanted to just share with all of you uh, in hopes that it would just encourage you as growing leaders or even just as uh, distributors who are really content with where 
you are at in your business. And he was, he taught, he calls it the 80, 15, five principle. And he says that 80% of the people that you bring into your organization are going to be people who are happy and excited about, you know, just building a business that provides maybe $300, $500 a month. And they're not looking for anything else. They're happy to just to casually um, help other people to help just refer. Um, and that's all that they're ever going to want to do. And they're happy to do it. He said that there's another 15% of the people in your organization who are really um, motivated and they're going to go for it um, for a time. And they're content with, you know, making maybe a couple thousand dollars a month. And, uh, but when life, you know, situations and troubles come, they're a little bit susceptible to kind of getting taken out of the race in the sense that it, it definitely slows them down and they may lose heart. But with a lot of encouragement and training, they can go really far. And he said there's about 5% of people in your organization that they are going to do this with or without you. They're going to go for it. They're going to, I mean, the sky is the limit for them. And I don't know if it necessarily equates to a dollar amount that they want to make every month, but, uh, but they are, they're the ones who, they don't necessarily, they don't really need you. They just, they need you to like, just let them run. And he was saying how a lot of times the people who are fives, who are in the, that 5%, fives who are in the 5%, we want to make them, we want to make them, um, sorry, I'm getting some feedback on my, on my screen now, and I don't know where that's coming from. Um, anyways, so <clears throat> the 5%, we oftentimes, we want to, we want to make everybody a five percenter. We want to, we want to make everybody this amazing grand like leader. And he said, that's just not realistic uh, because you have 80% of your organization. They were never meant to be that. And it's okay. They don't need to be that 5%. He's like, but you want to help them. You want to, um, you want to, you want to recognize and love them for, what they do, what they add to your organization. And if you can, um, if you can recognize them, if you can basically keep them happy, and I don't mean that in like a, uh, just appeasing them sort of way, but if it's, if you can, if you can help them feel loved, then you really are um, just applying the principle of having, you know, perhaps a hundred people working, you know, at 1% effort rather than 1% or, or one person working at a hundred percent effort, because those people are going to continue referring people into um, their team. And it may be slow, but, uh, but they're, they're a window, they're a gateway to another network of people. And so he just was really highlighting how important it is to recognize um, the ones who uh, are content with being less active, but they're still very valuable to your organization. And I just really, um, I really appreciated that because it's true. I, I can get into this, at least some, for me, uh, I can get into the mindset where it's like, you want to, you want to recognize and reward the people who are like really blowing up your organization, but they would be doing that regardless of whether or not you recognize them for it. And uh, so it's actually uh, better for your team, better for you as a leader, and better for uh, everyone in your organization to really um, celebrate, celebrate the small things and the, the those who uh, contribute in small, smaller ways. Um, I hope none of that sounded offensive, because I mean it in the best way possible. <laughs> um, but I thought that that was, that was really just kind of a wake up call for me personally. And um, yeah, I think beyond that, we just, we had a tremendous time getting con to connect with other leaders. Um, 
I think we personally, you know, felt like we had some clarity on some just next steps that we need to take as leaders. I don't know if all of those would really be applicable for everyone here. So I probably won't go into that right now, but, uh, but I just want to encourage you all, like if you have any desire to like, to really move, to go for it with life vantage. I mean, we have such a special, a special, company that we work for, a special family that we're a part of. I know I I haven't had another experience in another network marketing company, but there were many people in that room that did. And all of them that I talked to just said, we've never, we've never been treated so well. And, uh, and we felt it too. So I'm just really, I'm grateful for my team. I'm grateful for the opportunity to go and, um, it was really just a whirlwind, and I, <clears throat> I'm hoping that soon we, uh, my husband's position will be <laughs> at Pro Five, so we can go again because it was just life changing, and uh, just really would love to go back and soak it in some more. Yeah, we got to get you some skiing lessons again. Um, yes, to go back. That would be priceless. Thank you, Stephanie. And I, you know, I, I think. Um, the, the amazing thing about the culture that we're in and the timing we have to have the access to the CEO of the company that will be, you know, a multi-billion dollar company at some point. It's like if you could go back in time and hang out with Steve Jobs for a few hours on a weekend at a ski resort, you know, just you and a few friends, what would, what would that have been like? Right. Or the people that are, you know, the top producers, the top influencers and income earners in a movement like we were part of uh, it's just unheard of i mean i i i don't know about you um but i even in you know the marketplace i'm 54 uh home depot wasn't going to afford me uh an audience with our our ceo or even the executive team any anybody in the sales office so you know that it's just so bizarre when you think of and put it in those terms so i'm so proud of you guys um, please pass our congratulations on to Stuart as well. We had um, um, Donna Edwards and Robert Edwards, and I know you guys work closely together. And uh, Robert and Donna are responsible for a shift at the International House of Prayer. Um, they're a, a nighttime shift, so that's why they can't be on tonight to share. They send their love. Um, but uh, thank you, Stephanie, for representing uh, that crew so well and our team so well. We're so proud to have you guys on the team and we love you. Thank you for your contribution and for all you bring to the table, sis. Thank you so much. Thank you. Um, it's for, so if, if that sounds good to anybody, the next Pro 5 Summit is gonna be in September. Uh, there probably won't be a lot of snowmobiling and snow skiing to be had, but I hear that the Zermatt Resort in September is as lovely and as fun as it is in February. So. Those dates are September 19th through 22nd. If it is in your intention to make it to Pro 5 Summit, this next qualifying period, put that on your calendar. Make that a goal and just say, let your upline know. I will be in Park City, Utah for Pro 5 Summit in September. How do we do that? And make sure you have a, a support team around you that will support those efforts to achieve that goal for you. Um, man, it's, for us, uh, Krista got to go in the very early days of our business. And it meant a huge shift in the ownership that we were able to take in our business. I want to um, shift over now to uh, somebody that, gosh, I learned so much from all the time who, you know, if you're not careful, Julie White will outwork you because uh, she doesn't slow down. She doesn't, she doesn't take much time off. I can tell you that. She's a grandmom. She's a, a mom, um, amazing leader. And uh, the wonderful thing I always, I'm so proud and so inspired by Julie is she uh, is out in Mansfield, Pennsylvania and without, you know, the help of maybe Rhino and a couple other leaders out there. She's not had a lot of uh, folks telling her what to do, holding her accountable. And uh, Julie's just done it. She's just figured it out when there was a question. She, uh, she's, you know, she's a problem solver, not a problem articulator. And uh, I'm just so proud and blessed that uh, Julie and Jerry White are on your, our team. Julie had the opportunity to go down and spend some time with John Maxwell at an event down in Orlando, Florida this past week. And I asked Julie if she would take a couple minutes and just share 
Sister, from that experience, any takeaways, any inspirational thoughts you have? The time is yours, Miss Julie White. Hey, thanks, Mark. You and, bet. Uh, wow, all those gracious words. Now, now I don't know what to say, but uh, you know, I really appreciate everything you shared, Stephanie, and uh, that Pro Five Summit is so incredible. Um, but I want to share with you a little bit about John Maxwell, and I'm actually I made just a little PowerPoint so that you guys uh, could pick up a few things a little easier that. I think you'll find helpful. So I'm gonna go ahead and share my screen. All right, can you see that, Mark? Yes, ma'am, looks good. Okay, so uh, the John Maxwell event was amazing. It's called IMC, which is International Maxwell Certification. So by going to this event, you actually get a, a certificate and you can use it for you know whatever you want like coaching speaking training and you get access to a website that has a lot of material on it and a lot of resources that that you can use so if some of you probably remember uh, a couple years ago john maxwell actually came to life vantage and uh, we had some awesome training and some of us did the 15 uh, laws of growth uh, which which was great happened um, I just realized you know again how important it is to you know invest in ourselves and personal growth and development and we've all been um, you know taught uh, that that's an important part of our business so uh, I after he was at life advantage um, he he gave people the opportunity to actually join his group and so it was a financial investment that I decided to do and going to this event was part of that. So you can see here, I just have a, a little um, picture. Uh, let me see here. So anyway, it's like Stephanie was saying with the Pro5 Summit, this was like an experience that you really can't convey. It's like when we go to Elite Academy or convention, there were about 3,000 people there and I mean, you know, the people were just quality people and just connecting with the people was so valuable. Uh, you know, I, I just met so many like incredible people. Uh, the material that we were taught was awesome. I learned so much that, you know, I really can't even convey. Um, but um, I would just encourage you to, you know, take, you know, time to, uh, read some of his books as well. And here's just a few things that I thought would apply to uh, our business. Uh, you know, we all have heard about getting out of our comfort zone. You know, we, they talked about that. And, you know, when you really think about it, you know, what are we going to do? Are we going to step into growth or are we going to go back into safety? You know, when we're presented with an opportunity, I remember when I was presented with the opportunity to speak on stage and everything inside of me wanted to say, no, no, you know, I come up with some excuse. But, uh, you know, I stepped into the opportunity. And that's what we have to do. We don't want to be driven by our fear, but we want to be uh, motivated by our why. And, and then I believe, too, um, that our, our, um, the image of what we want uh, we have to stay focused on that, our mindset. Our mindset is just so crucial in this business, um, you know, and also our image that we, what, that, what, what others want, because we have to believe in them, you know, before they can possibly believe in themselves. So we want to help people to hold their own belief for their why, to help them to reach their goals and you know identifying uh internal challenges and overcoming them we had some really good teaching on that that i really need to um take some time to uh dig deeper into that because they were sharing just about how a lot of our self-programming actually holds us back you know are we making agreement for what we want or are we holding on to some you know misconceived ideas of of uh you know, things that we think maybe we can't do. Uh, and then another thing that, you know, we've been taught a lot in Life Vantage is just the importance of passion. And I know passion is so important in our business. And 
they shared, you know, that our passion will actually take us to heights that we could never achieve with our skill and intellect. So not that our skills, you know, learning our skills and all is, isn't important, but, you know, passion is an extremely important part of, uh, you know, sharing what we have. Here's a book that John Maxwell wrote. Um, I actually, this is the book that I purchased when I was there. Uh, when they shared about this book, they actually recommended this book for people that are in network marketing. And I had the opportunity to meet quite a few people that were involved in network marketing at, at this event, which was pretty cool. But this, this is a book about putting your dream to the test, and it's, it's a great book that I just started reading, so I recommend that. And then another thing that you guys can do to kind of plug in, because I know there's, there's so much that we can do with our time, and, uh, but this is kind of cool. It's a minute with Maxwell and, you know, just one minute a day, you know, he's going to share some, some great tips that you can, uh, receive. And the website for that is just johnmaxwellteam.com and you can subscribe for that there. So, um, that's about it. I mean, I, there's so much information, um, you know, for me, this was just the beginning um, you know, because like I said, there's a lot of training available um, on the website. And my main interest in this is the uh, coaching aspect of it. And uh, they, it's, it's a great resource for that. So I would encourage, you know, everyone to look into John Maxwell. He's been noted as, you know, uh, you know, the greatest leadership expert in the world. And he's sold millions of books. Uh, in 50 different languages. So it's pretty amazing. So that's it. Thanks, Mark, for giving me the opportunity to share and uh, hope you found that helpful. Well, that's awesome, Julie. Thank you. And I, I you know, the, the, I think the main thing that we wanted to make room for is uh, just to affirm and um, endorse what you have historically done as so many leaders on our team of investing in themselves. Um, and not to say that, you know, we want to promote John Maxwell or Eric Worre or Darren Hardy or Les Brown or there's so many, Tony Robbins, um, Bob, Bob Proctor. There's so many great leaders. Andy Andrews comes to mind. Um, we like these guys because they like us. So there's a mutuality to it. But we also trust them. We, we've been around their leadership. We've seen their influence. Um, we personally have experiences with their content as we apply it to our lives. So I just wanted to give you a, a chance to share from one of our beloved friends in network marketing and in leadership and personal development, John Maxwell. And I'm so proud of you guys for doing it. Um, Eric Worre says uh, you should be, he encourages us, you should be investing more in yourself uh, progressively as you start increasing your income in network marketing. That's actually how your income your business begins to grow. Uh, we all know, or hopefully we know, maybe perhaps not if you're brand new, but for things to change, we have to change. For things to get better, we have to get better. That is the X factor. Unfortunately, here's the trouble with LifeAnage. Everything else is taken care of. Uh, they, they make the pills. They print the checks. They do the logistics. They procure the ingredients. They put those little suckers together. They put them in the bottles. They do the events. They uh, help us coordinate all the training. They do the legal stuff, the compliance stuff. They even take on Amazon so we don't have to, um, sometimes very effectively and sometimes not as effectively. But the, my point is this. The only variable that remains is our personal growth and development. And uh, the, the better we get at uh, helping others and serving others and putting others first and connecting with others seems to be this crazy correlation that our checks go up. And our businesses grow, and that's the way it ought to be, I think. So thank you, Julie, for doing that and for sharing. And um, those um, that are on our Facebook groups, you've already seen some stuff that uh, Colonel Whistler's procured for us by Eric Worre. He's right in the middle of a uh, 20 and 30, recruit 20 people in 30 days boot camp, which is phenomenal. It's part of his GoPro Academy group. Um, there's a 14-day four day free trial or a dollar trial on that. LV Coaching, which includes our Master Pro 10s, Marcel Niederhauser and Tyler Daniels, and some of our Pro 9s and Pro 8s, Ryan Fry and Skip Campbell and some other guys, uh, are doing LV Coaching. And there's a 14-day free trial or a dollar trial on that one. So if you're looking for a place to plug in, there's no shortage of opportunities. 
Um, before we close the call tonight, I do want to make you aware that now there are now five, count them, five promotions that are ongoing from Life Vantage Corporate. Uh, I'll run through them quickly because we're almost up on our time. Of course, it's March Madness. Not just if you're a basketball fan, I hope you got your brackets in, but March Madness means for every distributor pack that you enroll, we enroll this month, you get a half a point for every silver pack, a full point for a gold pack, and two, two points for every platinum pack. Every point will generate $25 extra in your pocket on top of the royalty commissions that you're making as part of your fast start bonus pool. So um, they're taking the, the high end rollers every week now to the end of March and they're um, we're competing in a bracket, hopefully to compete for a grand prize of $5,000. Second prize is $4,000. Third place is $3,500 and fourth place is $3,000. Not too shabby for a month's work on top of all the other bonuses that you will be making to do that and the rank advancements that will be coming if you're competing in that. There's a, uh, a second half sort of um, consolation bracket that everybody else, those that do not qualify every week for, to, to maintain that top half bracket uh, will compete for an additional prize. Um, gosh, is that another 3,000? I think it's $3,000, I don't, I don't have that written down. But that's of course till the end of March. Also, to go along with that, we're generating Pace Setter Pro, or sorry, Pace Setter Program. Uh, when you hit Pro 2 in your first um, 30 days, that's a high extra $100 on top of all your, all your bonuses. If you hold Pro 2 your next month, that's another $100. If you hit Pro 3 in your first 90 days, I think it's 90 days, that's another $250. If you hold Pro 3 the next month, that's another $250 for another $700 on top of all that other stuff. Um, man, I tell you, Life Vantage Corporate is really stepping up to the plate with this. I mean, prizes are nice and swag is nice and coupons are nice, but a little of this, man, that'll, that'll help pay some bills, right? And now is the time to do it. Um, we also have, where am I on my page? Um, the physique transformation, 90 day transformation with physique first, fri first prize, guess what? Five grand, again, um, a guy and a gal will both win that or each win which one of those. Second place, um, and third place, we'll also get uh, prize packages, including uh, Life Vantage, Elite Academy, Kansas City, airfare and hotel trips and registration. Not too shabby. And um, the Ireland incentive trip is still ongoing. You've got two more months to qualify for Ireland later on this year. Don't lose your chance if you're in the running. I suggest you go to work before the time is up for your Ireland trip. And Chris and I are actually still working hard uh, to qualify for that. So with that, um, the only two things I want to mention, well, three things really, I like. Uh, the next Elite Academy will be in Kansas City, as I mentioned in July. Hopefully you've pre-registered for that. I think that's $129 pre-registration. Somebody uh, fact check me on that. Um, register online at, through your front or back office. Is that right? Anybody thumbs up $129? Anybody? Anybody? We'll go with $129 sold. Uh, the next Life Energy Academy event, both virtual and live, is going to be April 20th. That is the day before Easter Sunday. So put that on your calendars. Um, if you're going to be on the road, go ahead and register for the virtual event. That, that uh, pass will enable you to watch that virtual training for the whole week. So I understand people, families are going to be on the move. It's Easter week weekend, uh, so you might not be able to catch that live, but you will be able to catch up on it on the recorded event. And then um, building depth, for those of you that are interested in some solid systemic, maybe I should say systematic training, the building depth event is a quarterly event that happens uh, in St. George, Utah, the Dixie Convention Center in St. George, Utah. That starts at 4.30 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Uh, and we'll go that evening, Lord knows how long, and then you'll start bright and early the next day at, uh, I think, 9 o'clock and go t all day till 6 o'clock. Here's the cool thing, as we just mentioned with Stephanie and access to leaders, you've got some of the top income earners in the entire industry, not just a couple. There's like 20 in the room, and they're all sharing their very best stuff, their very best training in that room. It's a great time. It's a fantastic community. For more info, you can go to lifeanageacademy.com and search Building Depth. That's an Eventbrite site. Or you can go straight to the Facebook group, Building Depth, as well. I wanted to give a plug for that as well. We're over time. Thanks, everybody, for jumping on tonight. Thank you, Julie, for sharing. Thank you, Stephanie.
for sharing as well. I know some folks on this call, I see some names, some folks that are running very hard. Please let us know how we can help you guys. Prayers are being answered. I know that. Lives are being changed. Good job, everybody. We love you. Have a great week. Bye for now. Good night.